Hello everyone, it's Nile from the Brittards, and we've got another loot crate, and there's a hint, loot crate, there's a hint. Anyway, this is the Adventure Crate, which is basically, uh, this is one of the most requested things that Loot Crate has ever been asked for, so it's Adventure Time, Minecraft, and Zelda. And I know there's a t-shirt in this one, and we all love t-shirts, don't we? Oh yeah, and also, I, I missed video of the last crate. Look at him. Look at how nice he is. He's so adorable. Let's use, let's use camera. Oh, it's automatic. It's automatic focus. It's automatic. Oh, well. Now, let's dive into this loot crate with my humble little background on my new little desk setup. Look at that. It's so not tidy. Anyway, <coughs> I'll hide this from you. Oh, there's some cool things I can see already. You can't see the video now. Oh well, it was nice as an overlay. Now, first thing we have... Ooh! We've never had one of these before. Uh, cover that number. Uh, official member of Loot Crate. With a card. Okay, that's... I guess that's a new thing that they're adding. Ooh, I like that. I'm gonna go with this first thing. Ooh! I got a fin. What is it, a fin tin? <gasps> There's a figure in it! Oh, oh, it's a figure thing! It's an adventure time figure! Okay, look, okay. So we've got this box. It's a really nicely made box, I'm not going to use this. Proper Cartoon Network uh, brand. How do I open it? Oh, it's, oh, you pop the head off. Pop the head off, sorry. Me and my organisation. Oh, yeah, it is like a blind bag inside. But that is a nice tin. I'm going to use that tin. Oh, is it like squishy? Is it fuzzy? Look at these knees. Look at them. Just move that up there. It's for relevance. Oh, sweet! I got a little tiny square Jake. Look at that. Let's see. Focus. If I move it a bit further back. There we are. Look at that. Nice, tiny little Jake. There we go. That is actually really cool. It's uh, it's a little bit uh, rubbery. No, is it hollow? Oh, it must be. Yeah, but that's pretty cool. I thought I'd get Finn because it was in the Finn box, but yeah. Oh, there was a thing there. Did I rip it? Oh, no, I didn't. Let's have a look. Uh, let's see. Twelve figures. You can get Finn, Jake, Ice King, Marceline, uh, Fiona, Finn with an angry face and a sword, Cake, uh, Gunter, Bimo, oh, I would have liked LSP, and Zombie Finn and Jake, okay. I'm quite happy with Jake. Jake's going to be here with all my little loot crate figurines. You can uh, you can stand there with, uh, where did I put him? Here you go, with Dover Keen from last month's crate, which I did record, but I didn't record and all that jazz. Anyway, came in a really nice box. Clink, clink. <clears throat> yeah, that's actually quite a nice little collectible in itself. I'm gonna put that there. Nice, Union Jack. Anyway, ooh, hope no one saw what that was. I saw what it was. Oh, I've always wanted one of these. But they're bloody expensive. Now, I don't know if there's like a thing inside, anyway. I opened it up prematurely. Minecraft hangers. And it's got Steve and a creeper. Yeah. And I'm assuming it's a keychain, so I wanted to open it just so I take it out nice and slowly. Okay, what I get? Ooh. Okay, didn't think I'd get that. Oh, that's a little thing as well. Nope. Oh. Well, oh no, it's on the back, it's on the back knees. Anyway, uh, on the back we could have gotten, focus, a Steve, a skeleton, a creeper, zombie pigman, zombie, a cow, a sheep, a pig, and a sword, uh, or a pickaxe. And I got, here you go, professionalism. I got a little pickaxe, which is actually really nicely made. It is plastic, but it's really nicely formed plastic. Focus. Babouche. 
it's really nicely uh, modelled. Yeah, it's a nice little thing. It's a little keychain. I assume you're supposed to collect them, give us a little hangy thing. Yeah, happy with that. It's a little tiny thing, but I know there's more big things in this crate. One thing I haven't seen is a Zelda themed thing. Oh, heck. Oh, what was this? The Friend Zone soundtrack. Oh, is that from Polaris? Oh, crap, yeah. Oh, crap. Proper C yeah, that's a proper CD. Holy balls. Knees. Holy balls, yeah. This new setup is so, so effective. But yeah, uh, this is the Friend Zone, a podcast on Polaris. And yeah, I got the soundtrack apparently. Insert Dodger Scream here. That is pretty cool. I did not anticipate that. Considering it was the adventure crate, but yeah, it's a nice little sleeve. It's well printed. It's got a nice looking CD. Yeah, I'll take that. I am a very happy man. Right, leaning over. See what I can see. Oh, oh, I've seen something cool that I know someone's going to be jealous of. Oh, holy crap. Okay, I'm fiddling through. Okay, let's have a look. Let's pull this back. Uh, oh, nice. This is the Zelda themed item for the month. Focus. Ta da! Uh, you still can't see that. Let me get it out of this packet. Hello. Anyway, it's the Zelda themed item for the month. Yay. It's uh, it's interesting to go alone. Take this. I'm not sure if that's a Starbomb reference. Uh, I know it's from the original game, don't laugh at me, but still, uh, Starbomb's quite big nowadays. It's a bottle opener keychain, which is really good. And it's not focused again. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you can't exactly see it very well in anywhere. But it's got a this link and the loot crate symbol and the old man. God damn my bleeding camera. Nope, not gonna do anything. Nope, it's gonna do anything. But yeah, it's another little key thing. But it's a nice. Oh, you can see it maybe. Vaguely. Vaguely. Kind of. Yeah, that's, I'm not trying anymore. Oh, I can see a big thing. I'm gonna leave that over here. Fiddle around with what I got under here. Oh, God. Oh, that's. Oh, there's some cool things. Uh, let's go with the next thing that's always in the loot crate. Uh, the badge, the adventure, the adventure month badge. Oosh. It's got a Hylian shield, uh, Finn sword and a Minecraft sword. That is bleeding awesome to see that all in one thing. Even if you can't see the focusing because cameras are bad for you. That's my head, you can vaguely see my head. Oh well. Anyway, that's the loot crate adventure button, keeping that one. And there are some really random things that I didn't actually think I'd find in this. Uh, in this loot crate. But it's actually kind of cool. I ain't gonna lie. Alright, uh, this loot crate also featured uh, on the Facebook page. They mentioned that they were actually going to include some YouTuber items in this adventure, cr in the adventure crate. Which is kind of strange because it is the adventure crate. But yeah, first we have Markiplier. Markiplier stickers. Oh, they're, no wait, they're tattoos. I've just realised that. Yeah, they're proper like wolf star tash tattoo, like uh, you know the water you wipe. Water you go. It works. Knees done. Anyway, we've got another thing. Captain Sparkle stickers. I haven't watched Captain Sparkles in a while, but Captain Sparkles is always good. He's really pretty. They're really nicely uh, designed stickers. I'm not sure exactly uh, what some of these are from. Probably some videos that I haven't watched of his. But Captain Sparkles is still good. And yeah, I'll use that other knee. Anyway, and finally we've got this big, 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 big uh, sticker set. Uh, I don't know who that person is. I, I don't, I recognise the icon, but I don't recognise the person. Wait, that's a thing. There's Nian Strike, but I don't think that's her name. And we've got Jay Whits. I love Jay Whits. Jay Whits. Whits. And, oh, my camera loves focusing. There we are. And he's got uh, some Pokemon. That's, that's a not Rampardos, not Bas Blastiodon, the baby Blastiodon, and he's got a Hone Edge sword and he's dressed as Link, which is pretty cool to be honest, that's a bleeding, really good design, 
Maker, Polaris, the YouTube channel, uh, YouTube network, sorry, Captain Sparkles, Markiplier, Jew Jeff, I don't know who Jew Jeff Jeff forever forever. Goodbye. But yeah, there's some nice stickers in there, and I'm probably going to use some of them, probably. And finally, there's a big thing in this crate. And one second, let me just use my amazing, powerful things. Oh, don't know if you can see that yet. It is a Link T-shirt. Why am I doing? Why am I being an idiot? You, everyone can see that way. Yeah, it is a Link T-shirt with loads of little tiny, uh, courageous hero, bird rider, <laughs> power trials. All these nice little phrases that can be related to the Legend of Zelda series. Yeah, I'm not the biggest Legend of Zelda fan. I'm not. Don't hate it. It's a very good series. I just not my type of game and well actually no it is it is my type of game but I just never got into it in N64 I think the I think the most earliest game I played was Wind Waker yes yes Wind Waker and then Twilight Princess really might, might pique my interest actually but I haven't been attracted ever since anyway this is a lovely t-shirt as always Loot Crate does a really good job with their t-shirts Oh, Puzzle Solver. I was thought it was like Uzzle Over. I was like, what the hell is Uzzle Over? Anyway, this has been uh, the Adventure Crate. And it's been very, very good. I, will, I don't know why, but I'm really happy with them. But the Finn box, I don't know why. I think it's just because Adventure Time fan in me is having a little squeal. It's a really nice Finn box. And the, and the Jake little statuette, even though it's a weird, it's a very weird little statuette. Ooh, it's got like some weird white scuffs on the back of the tail. It's an awkward little uh, thing. I'm gonna have to read up on the book and see if that's. I think that's an. I think that's an exclusive item. Don't think you can get that anywhere else. But yeah, it's actually been a really interesting loot crate. One thing I noticed: there is no uh, magazine in this loot crate. No, there's no magazine in this one. I guess they took it out, I guess people couldn't be asked to read up on stuff, but... Yeah.